Hello, welcome back to my YouTube channel, Pravin Kumar Bamset. Today we'll see one of the SQL entry question that is, I'm having one table. It is having three columns, column A, column B, column C. It is having three records. So my requirement is that what from the entire table, entire records, I want to get the maximum value is 900. Okay. So this is my table. It's having three records from this entire three records. I want to get the maximum value. Okay. So, okay. This is the requirement. Okay. So by using SQL query, when to get the maximum value, okay. There are so many ways are there. We can able to log into the application. We can able to work, okay. So we log into the application. Okay, first we'll try to create one table, okay. Okay, so table, okay. So this is the table. Okay, so column A, column B, column C. Now I'm populating the three records. Second record. Record. Okay, now I want to fetch the data by using select state that is DRL. Select a star from table. It project all the columns and all the records from the test table. Okay, same 100, 200, 300. Okay, so go to the bottom. So this is the input. Okay, now 100, 200, 300. Okay, so before going to know, first we should understand one concept that is greatest function. So greatest function, what it will suppose I'm having 1, comma 2, comma 3. From this entire result set, it will give uh, see maximum value. Okay, so greatest function. Suppose I'm putting 10. Okay, so from this entire three, four columns, four records, we are getting so four columns, we are getting 10. Okay, same concept we are using here. Okay, now select star from take the same thing. Now try to execute from this from this a column a column b first record. So we need to get the maximum value, maximum value, maximum. How to get? We'll go for greatest function. So greatest a comma b comma c. Now you see 100, 300, 600, 900. Okay. Now from this thing, we need to get the maximum value. How can you get the maximum value? Go for maximum aggregate function. By using max, we can able to get this. Okay, this is the first approach. Okay, so by using greatest function. In a similar fashion, first approach. Okay. So there are so many approaches are there. We'll see if like three to four of them. Okay. So same thing now what happened? Now select star from test. Now what happened? So from this thing, I will get the max so maximum value. From this particular column A, column B, column C, I went, I will get maximum value. How can you get the maximum value? So max of A, comma max of B, comma max of C. Okay. So what happened from the entire column? Okay, column level I'm trying to do. Okay. So it is giving it is giving 700, 800, 900. So see, got the pointer. Now what happened now? From this three, from this three three, three columns, like 700, 800, I want to get the maximum. Value. How can you get? We are having one function that is greatest. So just now we discussed. It's a combination of greatest and max. Okay. So this is clear so far. We can put one column only. Yes. Okay. Okay. Max value. Okay. So clear. So one is so one is by using greatest function and max function, and other one is max function and greatest function. So, okay. There's so many ways. Other we are having one more way. We'll see. We'll go for one more way. see it's having column three columns okay now what i'll try to do i'm using select a from test okay first column second column and third column okay column a column b column c okay so i'm taking the same thing okay so column a column b and column c now what happened this is one result set this is one result i want to club all the results set. How can I curve? We know that set of by using set of we can able to club all things. Okay. So follow the coding standards when I'm writing anything. So take the same thing. Okay, see, I'm clubbing. So it, it's even 101. All the things are there. Okay. Now what happened? Now what I'm trying to do? Okay, so one second. Okay, now this is the thing. Next step is that what? Okay, see, now from this entire result set, I want to get the maximum value. Okay, now before that, we should mention one column alias. Okay, I will take this value. I can write one more outer query. Select star from bracket open and bracket close. Okay, so see what happened. So this is one table. Now what happened from this one, we can get max of column. Okay, see so what I'm trying to do. I'm taking the column A, column B, column B separate separately, and by using set operators, I'm clubbing like in a single thing. We can able to get the things done. Okay, and after what, what we are trying to write one more output query, and we can able to get the maximum value. 
Okay. Hope this is clear. So like this way is a maximum function. Okay. In a similar fashion, we can go for with class also. Okay. So take the same thing. Copy the value. So this is what clubbing all the thing. Now we're basing with class. Okay. Common table expression with CT. Okay. We can give any name. Common table expression. So this entire thing lacks as one group. One table, temporary table. Okay. So select star from CT. Now what we can able to get the maximum value. So max of call. Standards has no, so this is okay. Can you one column alias? Okay, max value. So this is another like so many approaches are okay. So see getting the points. So this is the thing. And we are having one more approach. We'll go for case statement, conditional statement. Okay. Select star from test. Okay, see what happened. I'll go for case statement. Okay, so this is case when. Okay, A greater than B and A greater than C. Then what we can write then? We can write A. Okay, so we can write okay. So A greater than or equal to B or A greater than or equal to C. Then we can write okay. So A, okay, A is bigger. Okay. In a similar fashion, what okay, we'll write okay. This is one thing. So we'll go for one more condition. When so B greater than or equal to C and then we can write what if we then we can we'll see the same thing we'll get some idea. okay then b okay so in a similar fashion else c okay so c will get to know what exactly we're trying to do i'll put one column on yes call okay now what happened this is our column okay abc is a column okay now so a greater than b okay a greater than equal to b so this is false okay so uh, so this is false okay now what happened so b greater than c is this also false? We'll go for C. Okay, so getting the points the same. When A greater than A is nothing but what 100 is greater than equal to 200. It's a false condition. So it won't go to next condition. Okay. Next to 200 is greater than equal to C. It's also false. Then we'll go for 300. Same thing, we'll go for logic. Okay, so 300 C and A. Okay. Now what we want to get? We want to get the maximum value. How to get the maximum value? Okay, so we don't want all things. So remove this value. Okay. Now try to execute. Okay. How can you get the maximum value? We can write the basic maximum function. Okay. Max of so this entire column. Okay, so maximum value. So clear so far. Okay, so for one one question, we almost have four, three to four approaches. Okay. So one is what one is by using greatest max and greatest and max function, other is max and greatest function. Next one is that what okay by using union all. So with class and by using case statement okay so like okay that's why if you try to solve this type of things you no know, like the logical thinking will get improved okay so that's why suggestion is that what try to practice as many number of sql concepts so that logical thing okay if you find any use case anything any other approach you can post in the comments okay if you like the content subscribe and share the channel thank you for watching